There are many ways to see the rainforest, but none quite like this. And off we go. Just the thrill of being so far up in the air and just being dangling your feet over the forest and flying through the trees. Tourists become Tarzan and Jane soaring through the jungle. But it was Sean Connery who inspired jungle surfing in a 90s film. So it wasn't so much about the ziplines to start with, it was about getting to all those different levels of the rainforest where all the action is. It took more than a decade to research and build five platforms. Not a single bolt or nail was used. Just friction holds tourists standing 20 metres up a tree. The spectacular views are arguably the best in town. And just behind the platform here is Mount Sorrow. Okay, that's our little mountain that you can see everywhere in Cape Trip. This is the only manually operated zip line in the world, which means guides can stop you at the highest point, dangling 23 metres above the rainforest floor. Tourists love it. 90,000 have jungle surfed the Daintree since it opened in 2003. It's just a fantastic view. You've just, got everything. Yeah, trying to get the kind of perspective that you wouldn't normally get, like over the top of the canopy and out to the beach. Adventure tourism in the far north is being heavily promoted after the Challenge Cairns Festival. Obviously we're an adventure tourism product and to bring um, more focus to Cairns on adventure tourism is fantastic. Michelle Retray, 7 News.